Hello everybody and welcome back just about to seven days to die. Let's see what version we're on. Version 2-2. Two, two. Congratulations, Josh. <laughs> I was quite specific in my first uh, ticket request, Josh, wasn't I? Um, this is not a request to update the server at this time. Do you remember that a little bit? Mm? Josh, do you remember that? You know, the very first thing I sent you. After I wished you a happy new year, mate. Mm? Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yes, well, thank you very much, sir. Please pass on my uh, kindest regards to, to Tracy. Anyway, how are you all doing? I hope you all had a wonderful Saturday evening. Unfortunately, we've had an interesting morning. And this is why you should all participate on our Discord. Because I can keep you all up to date with the latest shenanigans Hello. in Grimbodia. Uh, <laughs> Bundy Lack, thank you for the follow. Can I also say thank you for the hosts to the Hate Maker and Havaba42 as well. Yeah, my internet went down this morning. I, I was sitting here... You know, minding my own business, and then this thing came up on, on my browser window from Virgin Media saying that basically your internet's dead. We're running some tests. I thought, well, that's, that's new. I've not, not seen that before. That's quite fancy. And uh, then the internet promptly died. And then, then when I managed to get it all back, or it was coming back, I uh, I jumped onto my tickets with Bluefang to try and resolve the update for the server, which... Uh, Jeez. <laughs> Let's not go there, all right? Uh, good morning, Daxos. Good morning, Blakey. Like, good morning, Chio. Good morning, Stroke. Hello, Nina. Thank you for the stream yesterday, Nina. I do like a little bit of Geralt. And I love the way you say kebab. You start all streams with a little kebab song. I'll write you one. <laughs> You're right, Talc guy. Hello, Slim Boy. How's, how's the uh, cold Chinese this morning, Blakey? Like, what were, the, what were the chicken balls like? I've always found chicken balls strange the morning after, but. But strange in that kind of, they don't taste quite right, but my god, I'm going to devour them. Uh, I actually did have a Chinese myself last night, mate. I treated myself to a little uh, a duck fried rice. It was very nice, mate. It was very nice. Very nice indeed. Oh, where's the body god? Let's go and clear the area. Um, what are we doing today? Um, we've got a bit of time before the next hall. Next hall's 42, isn't it? So let, let's just spend the morning... I, th I think we'll have a nice big scavengement, eh? What do you reckon? I'll try very hard not to die horribly. Uh, we also need to... Oh, we also need to... Um, we need to put some thought into what we're going to do with regards wellness. Um, because we are, obviously things have changed in 2-2. So we'll, once, once we've cleared the area, we'll go back in. We'll have a look at some of the foodstuffs that we've prepped and made. And we'll have a look at what the new wellness... Um, statistics are. Now, some of the current food has been changed um, to increase wellness on them, but also some of the food that didn't have wellness now does have wellness. So, we really need to I suppose go back to go back to basics, because obviously everything we know up to this point has now changed with 2-2. Two, two. Um, let's clear up some of these novers. Oh, gosh, wrong bug. Um, <clears throat> all right, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Um, you nibbling on the old prawn crackers. I'm not, I'm not a massive fan of prawn crackers, mate. Um, prawn crackers are one of those things I tend to have, like, maybe one or two at the end of the meal. And then I just throw the rest of them away, dude. Um, I, I don't know what it is about a prawn cracker. It, it's not that I don't like them. I actually do quite like them, I suppose. It's just, I don't know. They're, they're just, they're, just, they're, they're a non-food type, aren't they? It, it, it's like eating air, I suppose. Uh, have your crops grown? You plan to... No, no. Let me go and chat. I didn't... I don't think so, dude. I did sort of give them a cursory glance. I know, um, Chris Stike, I think it was, in stream yesterday said that it took forever for them to grow in this mod, mate. So... Oh, no, they have grown. Yeah, yeah. My, um... Oh, no, hang on. No, they haven't. So, sorry, I thought that was the cucumber. No, not, not even on the next stage yet, Mojo. So, still in, um... Seedling stage, basically. Oh, crumbs. That didn't actually kill him. That was a surprise. Go away! I think we're getting too, too quick at uh, demolishing the corpse, aren't I? Good morning, uh, Zar. Good morning, XJ. How are you both doing? You right, Humanities? Hello, Slim Boy. Hello, Tout Guy. Nice things we eat, Shio.
blame me, blame me, blame me, blame me, blame me. I couldn't get the rhythm then, Blakey, mate. Right? I've not got my magical mojo dancing shoes on, I don't think. I don't have to go put the slippers on, fella. I just couldn't, I just couldn't get, I couldn't get the, uh, the rhythm. The rhythm wasn't getting me, dude. I don't know what happened then. You right, Dykoi? Good morning, fella. How's the new headset and how's, uh, how's Escape from Tarkov treating you? I was just saying uh, on the stream yesterday, uh, Dykoi, it's amazing how many people have started playing uh, Tarkov. Um, some of the uh, YouTube peeps that I, I sort of, I, I only follow like properly about three or four YouTubers, I suppose, yeah. really. Um, and, and even then, not, not on a daily basis or even a weekly basis, but so. Uh, oh, thanks for the follow, Roadrunner. There's um, quite a few of the guys that, you know, you know, if I'm rummaging around in games, you know, there's a fair few YouTubes out there that always cover the latest and greatest early access and upcoming games and all the rest of it. And quite a few of those have been covering Escape from Tarkov. And it also seems that Twitch seems to have a huge number of people playing it. Um, kind, of, kind of good to see, really, mate. I think I quite like that. Uh, early, early screenshot for the day. All right, I think that's everything pretty much covered around my base area. Um, it is getting late, so what we'll do is we'll head down into. Oh, I can hear one. <clears throat> we'll head down into the mine tonight. Then we'll start putting some thought into um, getting a really big scavenger run tomorrow. See, see if we can find like um, a potato farm in one of the towns. That, that would be really... I mean, I don't know how many potatoes Mojo and James have actually got. I mean, corn I'm not doing too bad on. I've got a couple of rows, which probably amounts to... Oh, it's actually getting very late. Um, I don't know. What do you reckon? About 20, 25 corn, something like that? But if it's going to take a week to grow, and it's five per meat stew, then that, that's not exactly... Uh, it's not going to feed the 40,000, is it? get back in <clears throat> you prefer skips yeah I, I, I think to me mate that that's the problem I, I, i'm not a big fan of skips either dude skips and prawn crackers i, I can take them or leave them dude like literally i, I, I could just even if i was hungry I, I just don't think i'd even be bothered with skips mate <laughs> i think they've got the same nutritional value as a uh, slightly moldy cardboard to be fair you right, road runner <laughs> Oh, thank you very much, mate. Uh, doing good, X XJ. Uh, just lurking while working. Nice one, dude. Nice one. Well, I hope it, I hope you have a a final few happy hours there, mate. I'm just gonna slurp on the coffee before it goes cold. <laughs>